The objective for this video is to conduct a hypothesis test for a mean when the population standard deviation is unknown using the p-value. In a previous video, we conducted a hypothesis test about whether or not the actual mean body temperature for human adults is 98.6 degrees Fahrenheit. The hypotheses are mu equal to 98.6 and mu not equal to 98.6. We will use the TI graphing calculator to calculate the p-value for this hypothesis test. We will begin by pressing STAT and then cursor over to tests. This will be a t-test, so we should press 2. We will be using summary statistics for this calculation, so make sure that stats is highlighted and press enter. Now cursor down and enter 98.6 for the hypothesized population mean. Cursor down and enter 98.25 for the sample mean. Cursor down and enter 0.73 for the sample standard deviation. Cursor down and enter 130 for the sample size. On the next line, we must make sure that we accurately specify the orientation of the alternative hypothesis. This is a two-tailed test, so we will make sure that the not equal to symbol is highlighted and press enter. Now cursor down to calculate and press enter. The p-value is given as 2.28 times 10 to the negative 7. In decimal form, this would be expressed as 0 0.00000228. p-values are typically expressed with four decimal places. In this case, the p-value has six zeros past the decimal place before a non-zero digit is encountered. Recall that the decision rule when using a p-value tells us that if the p-value is less than alpha, we should reject the null hypothesis. Since this p-value is less than 0.05, we should reject the null hypothesis. Statisticians frequently refer to this as statistical significance at a 0.05 level of significance. Since this is a particularly small p-value, even if we reduced the level of significance to 0.01, the p-value would still be smaller than alpha. So it can be stated that there is a statistical significance at a 0.01 level of significance. But regardless whether the level of significance is 0.05 or 0.01, the conclusion is the same. We reject the null hypothesis, so there is enough evidence to reject the claim that the mean adult body temperature is 98.6 degrees Fahrenheit. In this video, we learned how to conduct a hypothesis test for a mean when the population standard deviation is unknown using the p-value. 